so you already know what time it is. It's time to push the ball. Beautiful double crossover by Chris Paul. Woo! That was sexy. My opponent has Jamal Murray and Kristaps Porzingis as his first two picks on the Miami Heat. So this is a good game for our squad because we played great basketball. And the good thing about it is that we are almost in the playoffs in this season one in terms of the footage that I have on my channel so far. So that's good. Kristaps with the pump fake, I jump for it, he goes for the dunk. So after this game, I think I have two more regular season games, and then it's going to be the first round of the playoffs. And after the playoffs, I'm going to bring, bring you guys season... Oh my god, I can't even talk. So I'll be bringing you guys season two. Season two has a lot of gameplays as well. And I also try to incorporate some NBA Live in the mix, so that's going to be fun to see. I have NBA Live online leagues from season two. And then I want to do some my career as well, but I don't know which player to continue or to upload. I have so many different players. I don't know which one to continue, which one to get to 99. <laughs> I have um, I have a 91, I have a 90, I have another 90, I have 89, I have 87. They're all within the same, almost the same ratings. I just can't pick one to, to pick and upload. You know, I don't want to upload like <laughs> some builds that everyone always has. I want something unique, something that not many people have built. Does that even make sense? <laughs> have built. There you go. I used the wrong uh, wrong verb there. So I don't want to use a player that a lot of people has built. Um, so anyways, I'll try to talk about the gameplay. Look at Marcus Smart getting that steal. That is why I traded for this man. You know, I don't have to go for those steals myself. He can do it manually. You know, he has high IQ in terms of defense. So it really does bail me out a lot of times. And it's very helpful. Screen and roll CP3 to Marcus Saul. He hits the three. <laughs> Beautiful play right there. CB3 has that gold dimer. Marcus Hall has the catch and shoot. Dwayne Wade with a crazy mid range shot. So, with one minute left in the quarter, it's back and forth as you would expect, like I mentioned in my other video. I don't expect to blow anyone out in the first quarter. It's usually where the games are close. But in the second quarter and above is where you get to shine. Look at Chris Asperzingis going in the lane. He gets his takeover. So right now I thought Persingis would shoot a 3 or you know he would run a play for Persingis but he runs a screen and roll instead. I just wanted to double this guy. I fell for the pump. <laughs> I fell for the fake pass like a little noob and he ended up getting a slam. So I don't even know how many points Chris Tapps already has in this first quarter. But like I said in the second quarter is where you get to shine you know when your bench is in the game. Terry Rozier with a 3. I forgot to mention I acquired Terry Rozier and Harrison Barnes back from the Mavs. I gave him Wesley Matthews, I gave him Pick, I gave him... What was my backup? I gave him Shabazz Napier, I gave him another player, I forgot. I gave him like 2-3 players and a first round pick to get Rozier and Harrison Barnes. So now I have CP3, Marcus Smart, Harrison Barnes, and Marcus Saul and Dirk as my starting 5 and then with my bench. I try to use Terry Rozier. Oof, look at that dunk, baby. So my bench, I try to use Dirk, Rozier. You know, they're my main weapons off the bench in this season. So Dirk with a steal. <laughs> I don't know, Dirk's been playing some crazy defense lately. I don't know how. I think Marc Gasol has a defensive anchor, so maybe that's helping Dirk get these steals. So right now we're up by five. We're making our second quarter run. Beautiful movement. Harrison Bard's wide open off the play. So now we are up by eight points. Harrison Barnes has his takeover as you can see. Dribble drive into the lane. Crazy layup finish. That should have been an and one. He calls a timeout. So we are up by double digits. We're going to try to get another stop here. Look at Marcus Smart being a pest. I didn't even press square there. It was the computer all the way. So the computer got the steal. I ended up finishing it coast to coast. We're up by 12 now. He couldn't score. I'm giving it to Gasol in the paint. It's going to be too easy. He's going to do one on one coverage. Nice drop step to the slam, up by 14. So with 8 seconds left in the quarter, we're going to try to get a stop. Dwayne Wade drives in the lane, he gets a tough layup to fall. So that cuts the lean down to 12 going into halftime. So in the third quarter, he's going to run another play with Jamal Murray, but we're stepping up our defense. I read that beautifully, CP3 gets the steal. 
I find Marcus Smart with the bounce pass and the dunk. So in this third quarter, Chris Porzingis wasn't really a factor since the first quarter. We stepped up our defense, we started double teaming him. Jamal Murray pulls up in my face, we get the rebound. So you already know what time it is, it's time to push the ball. Beautiful double crossover by Chris Paul. Woo! That was sexy. So I'm running a play for Chris Paul right here. Actually, it's a play for Harrison Barnes and Chris Paul together. Chris Paul is the one that gets open for mid. Beautiful shot. He needs another timeout. We are up by 17 points. Chris Taps Porzingis can't believe it. Chris Paul is getting hype, baby. <laughs> but unfortunately, after this play right here, you're going to see my opponents. I think he ends up leaving the game after this three-point shot by Marcus Smart. We blew this game open. He ended up quitting the game. He told me he had to leave, but I don't know if that's true or not, but he's a good guy, so I took his word. He told me he had to leave, but it's all good. I waited even 15 minutes for this guy. I waited like 10 timers. Eventually, he left. But if you guys enjoyed it, let me know. I'll be definitely dropping some more, so drop a like, drop a comment. I really appreciate the feedback. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to get flashed, please be sure to share and like this video. To stay updated, click subscribe and also follow GFlash on Twitter.